Yo, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're gonna be making a Drain Gang beat for Blade for Drain Gang CEO. Yeah, before we get started, you know, make sure to go tap in with me on social media, give me a follow at Enviral, but let's lock in. Loki, I've been having fun making these kind of dreamy beats because you can really get lost in the sauce with these beats. I'm gonna try to show you guys some cool plugins to use for these kind of beats. All right, so I think I might go into Omnisphere first and actually go into the hardware library. This has a lot of cool like synth kind of sounds. I found this cool preset called Cold Shower. Let's play like a really basic kind of melody with this. I'm gonna bump it up to like 150. Those chords are pretty cool. Let's try to add like a top melody line to really emphasize it. I think I like that kind of like weird pattern. So let's try to record something like that. And then I'm gonna remove some of these notes to kind of let the melody breathe a little bit. And I'm probably not gonna quantize it because I like how it's like really off and uh, kind of like weird. Normally I would play this note like over here, like, because that's where the chord changes, but I kind of wait a little bit to play it. So I wanna have like this kind of drag with your notes. I think that could add a really cool like rhythmic feel. So I'm gonna try to like, flip this um, and also render it out. Let's try to see how that would sound. And then next I'm gonna reverse it to bring it back to normal. And let's put it back in the mixer. Let's try to stretch it actually, see what we could do. All right, that's a cool layer, but now we gotta kind of forget about that because it's so weird. Let's try to open up Super JV and put down like some chords. That's really nice. I want something more kind of defined and not weird for the main for the main pattern, you know. You know, just something to have the chords a little bit more defined and not so obscure with the main pattern. What I'm gonna do is actually just chop it up like this cause you know, we made it twice as long. So now the chords are twice as long and it doesn't match with this pattern. So, so I'm gonna pick every other one and then I'm probably gonna put like OTT on it or something to compress it heavily. That could be cool, honestly. That's a cool sound.
All right, I think that pattern really unlocks that drain vibe. I'm actually gonna lock in on a super like that and let's try to that could be hard I'm just gonna uh, put that in there the pad and let's I'm gonna add my pad a little mixer preset all right so let's just change this tremolator setting now I'm gonna put grow speed on the pad and just put a gate on it All right, so now we got a really nice foundation for all the melodies. Now let's try to add a couple more sounds, like little textures, and I'll show you guys some cool VSTs to use for those. First VST for some cool sounds is CS80 from the Arturia bundle. This has a lot of weird sounds that I like. Obviously, let's EQ that a little bit. Portal is definitely another cool VST that you can use a lot for drain gang beats. It does a lot of weird things to sound. Last day, I think I'm gonna add a bass for my one shot kit. I'm probably gonna pick this one. Obviously all these layers are not gonna come in at the same time, so I'm just gonna like delete this. Now let's put some drums on this real quick. I'm gonna pick sounds from Tetractus, which is a drum kit I'm gonna drop pretty soon. But yeah, let's lock in. I'm just gonna make the hi-hats a little bit bouncy, just like that. Let's pick some weird snares now. Alright guys, so that's pretty much it for this video. As always, you know, if you guys found this helpful, please make sure to give it a like, comment below what you thought of it, and also subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.